Hey, welcome back everyone. I am Matt Larson and I've been getting a lot of questions lately talking about what are we doing with the liberty movement after this year's election? What if Gary Johnson doesn't get in? And I've, I've, I've answered this question a couple times, but today I thought I would bring in a fresh perspective. Uh, Soraya Fish, uh, she's part of the Liberty Livestream. They went to many different events all over the United States. They live streamed the events. Uh, they were part of the Oklahoma Caucus, uh, part of the parking lot convention. I mean, these people were very involved in politics, so I thought that I would give one of the Fish sisters a chance to answer that question for you. So here she is, Soraya Fish. After the Republican National Convention last week and their blatant disregard for the rules and the voice of the delegates, where do we go from here? Do we stay involved? Do we back out? Do we join the Libertarian Party? No, we need to stay involved in the Republican Party. If we leave, that is exactly what the establishment wants. I think we have a great chance at taking back the Republican Party as long as we stay involved. In four years, the Liberty Movement can be much bigger than it was in 2012. The Republican Party is already built and we can use that to advance the Liberty Movement. Get involved at the local level, become precinct, county, and state chairs. As we saw with Nevada, Minnesota, and Iowa, the GOP is now controlled in those states by liberty-minded individuals. In 2008, the states are not like that. It's taken them four years to get, or more, to get where they're at now. So follow their example and take over your party. Um, in 2016, just imagine if we had so many more states that cast all those votes for somebody like Ron Paul, then we can really win. The growth we saw from 2008 to 2012 was outstanding. Just imagine how much larger the Liberty Movement might be in four years. So stay involved, don't give up. An idea whose time has come cannot be stopped by any army or any government. If we just give up, that's like saying to our children and grandchildren that we didn't really care if they lived in a free society. You know, we don't care if they live in a communist Germany, country like Germany. We have to stay involved. This is not just about the here and now, this is about the future. And if we all just give up, then that's sort of like saying goodbye America. So mm -hmm. just keep on going and we can win this by God's grace.